everybody. What is up? It's Thunder 2017. Come on in. Happy New Year to all you guys out there. And for the first kill of the new year here on the channel, is it going to be a weevil? Is it going to be a well, hit marker? Nope, it's not going to be a weevil. Wait a minute. Oh, bam, bitch. Start off the 2017 on the right foot. First kill on the channel of the new year. Hot and fresh C4 sandwich. Anyway, alright guys, so I was going to upload another video before the end of the new year, but that last video just, it was just perfect. It was a perfect way to end 2016. Me getting uh, just dominated by bullshit, the uh, jitter modded uh, brekkie, just dominated by bullshit. And that's pretty much how YouTube 2016 went. YouTube 2016 was just dominated by bullshit. And I was having a talk with 8 Thoughts the other night, and he even told me, he goes, man, do you remember when YouTube was about good content? Now it's just all about bullshit and cringe and... And drama and it's just crazy to see the direction YouTube has taken over the uh, years things are not like they were when I first started man and I can't even count how many times I've said that it's just it's just shocking how far shit has gone uh, I still try and do things the old way even though it's not really working uh, sub wise I guess but that's cool man because I never really came out here trying to get a million subscribers I've already gained more subs than I thought I ever would in my life what was my 690,000 never thought I have that many ever so, I'm just going to keep doing me, man. Keep doing me. I'm going to keep playing Black Ops 3 because, quite honestly, this is the only COD I really enjoy playing. Uh, the, and you know what? The MW uh, COD 4 Remastered with the supply drops kind of gives you something to grind for, but still not really too interested in that game. Not really interested. And bust out the Annihilator pistol. Oh, get on, baby. And I'll tell you guys something right now, man. A lot of people ask me why I use shock charges and C4s. Uh, actually, Herm, you tell them. Tell him what's up, Herm. You play to win the game. Hello? You play to win the game. You don't play to just play it. Exactly. Thank you so much, Herm Edwards. I play to win the game, people. That's why I'm out here. And, all right, so listen, I didn't really... <laughs> <laughs> C4s and uh, them shock charges are damn effective in this game. Especially all the blast suppressor dudes running around. Them shock charges really watch my back for me. Uh, but listen, if I did upload a video before 2016 ended, I definitely would have talked about that Ronda Rousey fight against Amanda Nunes. Oh my goodness. I mean, if you got up to get a beer or take a piss or grab a snack or something, that fight was over. I mean, holy shit, dude. And honestly, I would rather see a fight like that. That reminds me back in the day, like the old Mike Tyson days, when Mike Tyson would just come out and just floor people in the first round. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It would be over. I'd rather see a fight like that than see uh, like a Floyd Mayweather fight where the dude's dancing around the ring. Not saying he's not talented. Floyd is supremely talented. For him to be dancing around the ring, jabbing people, I mean, nobody could beat him, right? His style is like unbeatable. Uh, so I'm not saying Floyd is not a good boxer. He is. I'm just saying I would rather see a fight and quick. Then watch some dude dance around the ring and jab somebody for 12 rounds. But, uh, damn. Now, everyone's saying Ronda Rousey should quit. And let me tell you something, girl. R Ronda, first of all, don't shut off social media. Don't ever go on social media. You don't want to see what these dudes are doing to you out here. Uh, but listen, if you still have the desire to fight, and if people will still show up to watch you, if you can still pull an audience, then keep fighting. Dude, I wouldn't want to end my career like that. I'll tell you that right now. I would definitely come back and try and go out with Lisa W. I wouldn't want to end my career like that because that was ugly. Uh, so, Ronda, keep fighting. I, I hope you keep fighting. I really hope you don't retire. My two cents on that. But speaking of famous females who should retire, holy shit. Did you guys see Mariah Carey last night on ABC? The New Year's, Rockin' Eve, the Dick Clark, Ryan Seacrest, whatever it is, dude, Ryan Seacrest. Did you guys see Mariah last night? It was number one thing trending. Oh, two-piece baby? It was the number one thing trending on Twitter when I woke up this morning. I thought it was because Mariah Carey died. I didn't stay up till midnight last night. I don't give a shit about staying up. I haven't stayed up till midnight to watch the ball drop since I was, I don't know, a teenager or, like, or maybe in my early 20s. The older you get, dude, the more holidays you just don't give a shit about. Like, Christmas is cool. Uh, you know, if you have children, Christmas is cool. But, like, if you're a grown adult and you don't have any kids, I mean, it's just, holidays are just boring. You know what I'm saying? They just, they get boring over the years. So, I woke up this morning, and boom, number one thing trending was Mariah Carey. I thought she died. I was like, oh my God, what did they do to Mariah? Oh, no. Because, you know, I like Mariah Carey. She's a good singer. But anyway, so I found out that Mariah Carey didn't die, but her career did. Did you guys see that shit last night? Her performing? Where something happened, the, her mic got hacked. I don't know what happened, dude, but she was supposed to be out there lip syncing. 
She was out. I mean, she was doing some straight Millie Vanilli. I actually, I can't even compare it to Millie Vanilli because Millie Vanilli. I mean, <laughs> Millie, if Millie Vanilli seen that, they would have rolled over in the graves. Is Millie Vanilli still alive? I know one of them died. Is the other guy dead too? I uh, Millie Vanilli was. I don't even care that they were lip syncing, dude. <laughs> Girl, you know it's true. G -g 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 <laughs> Ooh, 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 I love you. <laughs> Millie Vanilli, oh my god, I'm actually singing Millie Vanilli. What a way to start off the year, people, what can I say? So, I mean, listen, Mariah, you got caught trying to lip sync. Mariah, why are you trying to con people, dude? Mariah, if you want to scam and con people, get the fuck off TV and come to YouTube. Just tell people straight up, look, I'm Mariah Carey. You know what I'm saying? I'm one of the greatest singers of all time. My voice is shot. But I still want to be out here performing a few people, so I'm going to be lip syncing. Just come out here and let people know. I mean, she was out there trying to act like she was really singing. And first of all, Mariah, well, why are you still even out here doing this? <laughs> Yo, Mariah Carey is worth $520 million. $520 million? Yo, if I had $520 million, none of y'all would ever see me again, ever. I would be gone. Work? What? Get the hell out of here, son. You work for me. 520 million, you don't work, you have people work for you. I would never work another day in my life. As a matter of fact, I would vanish. I'd be gone. 520 million, she's still out here hustling. Damn, some people, listen, you need to know when it's time to go, period. I mean, the girl's got more money than she could possibly ever spend in her lifetime. Now, a few of you guys out there might be like, well, maybe it's not about the money. Maybe she just enjoys being famous. Dude, who the hell actually enjoys being famous? Dude, being famous in today's day and age of social media, being famous is straight AIDS. Being famous sucks. Trust me. I'm not even close to be I'm I'm not even sorta of famous and I think this shit is AIDS. I can't even imagine what these these bigger people must have to deal with. Dude, being famous sucks. <laughs> if nobody knows who you are, be grateful. You better cherish that shit. <laughs> Trust me. So <laughs> she got caught. It was pretty damn embarrassing. And hopefully maybe now she will I think Mariah should retire. Her voice is gone. I mean, unless people are cool with her coming out there lip syncing. And listen, just be upfront and honest. Be up front and I said, listen, my voice is shot, but I still look good. Let me come out here and lip sync. People won't even care. Nobody will care. As long as you're up front and honest, nobody will give a shit. It's a fact that you're trying to pull a fast one on people. That's what gets people triggered. That's what bothers people. But anyway, that, that's my two cents on Ronda Rousey and Mariah Carey. Ronda, keep doing your thing. Mariah, leave. Go, go live on a private island someplace, Mariah. With your 520 million. But anyway, all right, fellas. First video of 2017. And let's kick it off on the right foot. Everybody pimp smack the shit out of that like button. Thank y'all so much for the support. Let's start off the year on the right foot. And I will make a New Year's resolution. I'm not, I'm not really not much for New Year's resolutions, but I'll make one right now. I'm going to try and diversify this channel a bit. I'm definitely going to upload some Battlefield 1. My New Year's resolution is to finally make that Battlefield, that EA uh, account, so I can actually play some Battlefield. And probably get some Titanfall 2 up here. I think I just want to mix it up in 2017, guys, until I see what Sledgehammer's making. Uh, I mean... <laughs> <laughs> Did I just say that? Oh my goodness. I don't know, but my New Year's resolution is definitely mix it up on the channel and not just upload Black Ops 3. Even though, in my opinion, it's the best Call of Duty that's out right now. And it's just the, the game I enjoy uploading and playing the most. But I'm going to try and mix it up for you guys. I know you're sick and tired of seeing the same old, same old. I'm going to try and mix it up. I'm doing it for you guys. If it was up to me, I would just upload Black Ops 3 because this is why I enjoy playing. Uh, it's super easy for me to get gameplays. And I'm just good at it. And, you know, it's really not uncommon to enjoy something you're good at. But, all right, guys, that's all I got. Thank you all so much for the support. Hope you have a happy and healthy and safe 2017. And I'll see you guys on the next one.